On Sunday, September 8th, 1991, Jonathan Lee, 19 years old, he was with a group of friends, about seven others, and they were going to do some scuba diving. The group had gone to Snappers Point, which is at Altinga Beach in South Australia. Uh, they were in murky water. They were about 400 yards from shore in 60 to 70 foot deep water, and it's about 3 o'clock. They're swimming back to the boat, and Dave Roberts, he says that he saw a colorful rock down at the bottom of the water. So he swims down to the seafloor to check out this colorful rock. He says when he gets down to this rock, he can hear a thunderous roar in the water, and it sounds almost like a boat. And he says he turns, and he can see the, the water is all dusted up. There's a shark on the way by him, and he ducks behind this colorful rock that he went down to check out. He says the shark just went by him, and then it swam slowly past him again going on the way out. It had his buddy in its jaws, and it just didn't even look at him, just kept on swimming and disappeared. Uh, they launched a search for him. The other friends did not see the shark until it was already on to Jonathan Lee, so they couldn't even warn him. As soon as Dave Roberts had seen the attack, he swam to the surface, yelled to everybody else. They already had the boat started and were on the way over to get them out of there. Now, a search was launched, and all they ever found of Jonathan was a piece of lung tissue and a little bit of shredded wetsuit. Uh, that's all they ever found of him. So this went down as an attack a predation, fatality. Uh, they said this was a four meter great white shark, so you're talking a 13, 14 foot shark was responsible for the attack. That is our attack on Jonathan Lee.